Hello and welcome to AI Fundamental section of the AI ML Bootcamp. In this module, we'll review how multimodal models like Generative Adversarial Network or GAN works. Imagine a creative duel between two artists. One is trying to paint some realistic portrait and the other is acting as a critic to spot the areas of the image or if the image is not looking realistic. This fascinating battle will lead to some marvelous painting. Now in this painting example, if you replace the human artist with AI or neural network models, then this working principle will mimic how generative adversarial network model or GAN works. These models have the capability to perform varieties of tasks and complex tasks. Some examples could be generating realistic image from a text prompt. It can also create video content from text script. It can combine text, image, audio and it can generate output of a video and audio. Maybe you can feed text file, static image and audio of a person and you can request to generate a deep fake video for that person. GAN is one of the multimodal models available in market. As I explained with the artist example, GAN is a combination of two neural networks. One is generator and the other is discriminator. The generator creates new data instance and you can imagine this is just like an artist which is creating realistic paintings. Whereas the discriminator, this is again a neural network, it evaluates the data. You can consider it's like an art critic who judges whether the paintings are real or fake. During the training process, the generator and discriminator are trained together in a competitive setting. The generator tries to create realistic data to fool the discriminator while the discriminator will try to get better by distinguishing the data is real or fake. Let me take an example. Let's say the task is to generate image of a lady. The generator creates the image and the discriminator check if that look like a lady or not. Next is the feedback loop. The feedback loop has two steps. One, the generator improvement when the discriminator correctly identifies a fake data, it will provide feedback to the generator on how to improve. On the other hand, the discriminator improvement, when the discriminator is fooled by the generator, it will learn from the mistake and it will get better by spotting the fake. It's an iterative process, training and feedback. It will take place in multiple level of iterations. And then finally, the prediction. GAN can be used in multiple different applications. It can create realistic images such as faces of a human or animals or even landscape picture. It can also be used in art and music creation. It can generate additional training data for machine learning model. Let's say you have a training data set and that data set is missing some representation or maybe you need to generate some more data. GAN can help you in that case. In this slide, we'll review the name and purpose of some more machine learning model that you may come across in the examination. You don't have to understand how this model works, but you should know what are this model and what are the use cases at high level. To start with first GPT, that is Generative Pre-trained Transformer, which is the main driving model behind chat GPT and GPT can generate human-like text or source codes. Next is Google BART. BART is bi-directional encoder representation from transformers like GPT, but it can understand the context of words in a sentence bi-directionally, and it can be used in language translator. Then SVM, support vector machine. This machine learning algorithm used for classifications and regressions. Then WaveNet. WaveNet can generate audio waveform and it can be used in speech synthesis application. 
नेक्स्ट इज आर एन एन और रेकारेंट न्यूरल नेटवर्क रेकारेंट न्यूरल नेटवर्क यूज इन स्पीच रेकग्निशन टाइम सीरीज प्रेडिक्शन एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा देन नेक्स्ट इज रेस्ट नेट और रेसिड्यूअल नेटवर्क रेसिड्यूअल नेटवर्क यूज फॉर एगेन इमेज रेकग्निशन ऑब्जेक्ट डिटेक्शन फेसियल रेकग्निशन एंड देन ज्ञान ज्ञान वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड इन द प्रीवियस स्लाइड ज्ञान कैन बी यूज टू जेनरेट सिंथेसिस डेटा एंड इट कैन बी हेल्पफुल इन डेटा ऑगमेंटेशन प्रोसेस फॉर मशीन लर्निंग एंड लास्ट बट नॉट लिस्ट एक्स जी बूस्ट और एक्सट्रीम ग्रेडियन बूस्टिंग ग्रेडियन बूस्टिंग इज अ पावरफुल मशीन लर्निंग टेक्निक दैट इज यूज फॉर रिग्रेशन एंड क्लासिफिकेशन द मेन पार्पज ऑफ एक्स जी बूस्ट इज टू एनहेंस द परफॉर्मेंस एंड स्पीड ऑफ ग्रेडियन बूस्टिंग मॉडल्स सो दिस वॉज द ऑल मॉडल्स यू शुड नो ऑन ए हाई लेवल फॉर द ए आई प्रैक्टिसनर एग्जाम दैट रैप्स ऑफ दिस मॉड्यूल आई होप दिस सेशन हेल्प यू गेन अ डीपर अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड ब्रॉट यू वन स्टेप क्लोजर टू योर लर्निंग गोल्स Thank you very much for watching and learning with us at Cloud Expert Solution. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more update and feel free to drop any question or feedback in the comments. We would love to hear from you. See you in the next module.